You know what's also different? Yeah. The weather. It's never this good yes. for Labor Day. It's been so nice. <laughs> right? Really. No, it's, uh, I mean, we've had a few that have been like this, but boy, this is a long stretch or a longest stretch of really consistent weather we've had all summer. I, the timing is uh, amazing right now. In some ways, it's good that we're getting this pattern this time of the year. If this was happening about a month ago, six weeks ago, when we were at the, the height of our summer heating, this could be driving it up into, you know, upper 90s potentially. At least at this point, it looks like we shouldn't reach the 90s. We might touch a couple places, might touch 90 midweek next week, but most places will not, and that's just fine. Taking a look outside this morning, uh, we're nowhere near that today. It's going to be another comfortable afternoon. We had 81 out at SeaTac yesterday. Starting off today, though, with fewer clouds and uh, fog around. There's a little bit up around the strait and just some patchy fog elsewhere right now. Not much to be seen there from Painfield and Everett. And you can see there at uh, looking back across from Alki, things definitely brightening up behind downtown Seattle. It's always some nice color there with that first light. Looking up in the mountains, uh, the Tatouche Range uh, looking out there towards uh, looking towards the Tatouche Range up on Rainier. You can see clear skies in the mountains. Temperatures, by the way, running mostly in the 50s right now as you head out the door. Our mountain forecast does call for sunshine today. Temperatures at the highway pass levels warming up into the mid to upper 70s. That freezing level is still well above 14,000 feet. Out along the coastal beaches, they see a little bit of patchy fog this morning. Otherwise, sunshine and high temperatures in the upper 60s to the mid 70s. University of Washington model showing not much in the way of clouds around this morning and plenty of sunshine. As we head towards uh, tomorrow morning, probably even less, and if we'll see some clouds along the coast, it does look like we'll start to see a little bit of a marine push on Friday night into Saturday. So we'll start Saturday with cloudy skies, cooling back a few degrees, but still a warm afternoon on Saturday. And then an even larger ridge of high pressure heads away for sunshine and temperatures may be pushing in the mid to upper 80s. We head towards the middle of next week. So sunshine today, mid 70s to low 80s, upper 70s, low to mid 80s tomorrow. Back around 80 on Saturday, maybe a degree or two warmer on Sunday. Still a real good looking weekend. Labor Day itself, mid 70s to low 80s and then Tuesday, Wednesday and probably Thursday temperatures pushing into the mid to upper 80s. It does cool gradually later next week, but at least at this point, it looks like that sunny weather will last all the way through a week from this weekend at least.